Thanks, guys. Now, before you eat all that chocolate, you probably want to have a decent meal. We're out here in the public's kitchen with executive chef Brad Souflon from Wicked Barley. And you guys have already taken bar menus to a high level. But today, you are making grilled skirt steak with <laughs> palm puree, shishito peppers, shallots, and veal reduction. Mouth watering. What's going on, man? <laughs> so, <laughs> it's, it's a lot. So, what we here we have a four ounce piece of skirt steak. Um, we get this from a local farm. It's very, very good. Uh, what we're going to do here is we get a little salt and pepper, lightly season it just a little bit. Don't want to go too crazy with it. We're going to get that started over here on the grill to my left. I'm let you get on that. Okay. Get that going on there. Get that get nice and hot. Uh -huh. uh, then over here we have our shishito peppers. Now, are those hot or just flavorful? More flavorful than anything else. Um, every probably one out of a hundred, you might get surprised. You like you take a bite out of it because <laughs> it gets you fooled a little bit. And you're like, whoa, 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 give me some water. But um, these are more flavorful than anything else. What we're going to do here, though, is we're going to take them up and we're just going to char them. Okay. We're going to blister them a little bit more. Okay. So we're going to take them right over here to the grill. You're very uh, grill focused today. I like it. And get those charring up nice and nice and good. And then what I have here is already kind of prepped right here. It's going to be some shallots. So what I have is some shallots that have been thinly sliced on a mandolin. Mm -hmm. um, and then we take a little bit of brown butter and we par cook them just for a couple minutes, get them going. Um, from there, we'll take them and also throw these on the grill. And then get them a little crispy. Oh, um, and get them ready. So we'll slide that with the paper and everything. The paper's paper will, not going to burn. It'll, it'll burn a little bit, um, nothing too much. And we'll flip that right off. It's only gonna be on there for about a minute or so. Okay. So, yeah. Now, how did you come up with this recipe, man? Because it's like a nice combination of flavors that a lot of people might not consider at home. Uh, it, it, a lot of it's just from a few places I used to work at. Um, uh, it was a lot of, of Spanish food, tapas, um, grilled skirt, they do a lot of uh, Argentinian style cooking. Um, get that deep, deep char. I think that with a little bit of French uh, cooking in my background with the veal reduction and the brandy reduction. Um, it just kind of comes together and makes it fantastic. You're bringing that five star to the bar. I, you know, you're trying to every now and then, you know, just a little bit. I so, mean, you turned me on to the cheese curd burger, <laughs> man. So I'm that, willing to follow you wherever. So we're just going to rotate that just for a minute. You see, it's kind of bubbling, turn the crackle up a little bit. And we don't ever check. have to flip those at all, right? No, we should be good all the way through okay. on that. I'm just double check that skirt. That skirt is going good. All what right. about the palm puree? How does that work? So palm puree, we have that. We, we took our, our new potatoes and we, <laughs> it's a process. <laughs> we threw them through a ricer, which breaks it down that first stage. And from there, we, we pass it through what's called a tammy. Mm -hmm. It's a fine mesh strainer. You do that about two to three times uh, involved with some butter and a little bit of heavy cream and it gets the smoothest potatoes you'll ever have. And, You'll we'll definitely see that a little bit later. Out here. Okay, okay. Now this is just one of the things that you guys do. You guys, your menu is very expansive. And you know, you guys are seeing this like, when are we gonna get to it? Well, we're gonna come back a little later and we're gonna pair it with some beer. But That's in the correct. meantime, you guys have these killer wings, that cheese curd burger. Have you added anything else to the menu since we hung out? Uh, not right now. We're actually going through a few different variations, of playing around with some specials and different things like that. So we will be looking into this this new year, um, uh, switching some things up a little bit, giving Ooh. us some things that just don't. Aren't I know who's far. getting an invite. <laughs> yes. You need a taste tester. <laughs> I'll bring some friends. All right. So Brad's gonna finish this off, hook it up. And then we're going to meet up with Philip Maple. He's the brewmaster. And we're going to pair these together, get a little sample, and show you just a little bit of what they do at Wicked Barley. Now, you guys stay with us. We're going to have more River City Live right after this.